What's up YouTube? Me, Jake, back again from the video. This video, I just want to go over the topic of religion. To a lot of people, religion is very important. It's very important to me. Uh, a lot of, you know, people have gods and whatnot. Some people don't have gods. And it's the way you know we are. So, let's get started. Uh, just so you know, I don't have anything against religions. I'll cover my religion first, just so you understand. Uh, and why I don't like so many people that are part of my religion. So here we go. Uh, I myself am a strong Christian. Come from a very strong Christian family. Uh, but there's some problems with the Christian people right now. Such as abortion. For some reason, a lot of uh, Christians like to get involved with people who have having abortions. There was this uh, lady who had an abortion. And then she came to our church a few months later. Saying that she felt so sorry that she had an abortion and she shouldn't have gotten it. And everybody was just so upset and so disrespectful to her about her abortion. My family and I were the only ones that were really nice about it. Because, see, I believe that it's not my decision to choose who gets an abortion or not. It's their decision. And a lot of people say, well, it's God's decision, too. God decides when the baby's, uh, if the baby should be aborted or not. Uh, yeah, I mean, my religion standpoint, I sort of believe that. Uh, but... <laughs> Christians are just so nosy. I mean, I believe, from what, I mean, I have, you know, Mormon friends, Muslim friends, Jewish friends, Catholic friends, Christian friends, all these friends, Buddhist friends, atheist friends. And out of all of them, the Christian ones are the most nosy, nosiest. They think everyone's business is their business. Uh, a lot of Christians are very rude, too. Like, uh, what was it? I don't, remember, I don't remember who it was, what happened, but some, some, Somebody uh, at our church came to church. It was like, I need help. I did this. And this lady's like, we're going to be going to hell because you did that. Or you don't believe in Jesus Christ. You're not going to go You're not gonna go to heaven. You're going to go to hell. You're going to burn eternity. It's like, you know, show the person some respect. Just because they're not the same religion you are, you don't agree with it, doesn't mean that you have to, like, totally hate them. I mean, I don't, if they're, if they, Muslims chop off Christian heads, yeah, I'm upset at the Muslims that chop off their heads. Or the jihad, excuse me, but I'm not, I'm not upset at the Muslim guy standing next to me. He he couldn't do anything about it. So why are you all mad? Like, like after 9-11, I believe, uh, I was like four when 9-11 happened, so I don't remember this. I just remember my mom telling me stuff. People would go around uh, beating up uh, Muslim people on the street just because of 9-11. It's not their fault. It's the jihadist's fault. I'm just using this as an example is all. But it just seems wrong to me that... Christians are, and the funny thing is with Christians is, uh, I, I don't do this because it's what I hate. Uh, people are like, the Christians are like, oh, I'm, I'm a, I'll be the judge of that. You know, I'm going to judge you. This is right. This is wrong. You can't do that. You can't do this. You're going to go to hell. But then whenever a Christian gets judged, like, oh, you cannot judge me. God is the only one that can judge me. It hurts my head. Okay? How can... You be the judge of them, but God is only the judge of you. In the book of the Bible, it says that God is the judge of everybody. He decides who goes to heaven, who goes to hell, if you accept Jesus Christ in your heart today. You know, Jehovah's Witness stuff. That's pretty much it. It's not your call to decide if they're right or wrong. They have an abortion, maybe they agree, they agree with it, but you don't. Tough shit. God's call, not yours for Christians. Yeah, that's just what I hate about my religion. I hate the people. I don't hate the religion. Just some of the people are really irritating, very judgmental, complete assholes. Okay, moving on. Catholicism. Uh, I've heard that it's pretty much just the same thing as Christianity, except for they believe that uh, Mary, Jesus' uh, m mother, is higher than Jesus. Which, how is that similar? Just because it has Jesus in it, part of the religion? They worship two different people, so I don't see why people say that's similar. Oh, well, they do originate from the same part of the world, but uh, anyway, moving on. Uh, Islam, uh, they believe in Muhammad, and I believe their prophet. No, excuse me, they believe in Allah, and their prophet is Muhammad. Uh, people get Muslims and jihadists mixed up. They're like, oh, he's Muslim, he's a terrorist. No. I have Muslim friends, and they don't freaking try to blow me up. Okay, there's a, people, there's a difference between Muslims and jihadists. Muslims are the ones, you, you know, they, 
worship, or they put masks on the floor, I believe, and they, uh, you know, they put their forehead on the floor and whatnot. Uh, they do that kind of stuff, and so do the jihadists, but the jihadists take it to this extreme where they're like, okay, they're not a Muslim, we're going to go kill them. Muslims are just like, hey, what's going on? You're a Christian? Cool. That's it. So you don't need to get your freaking, like, panties in a wad, because this guy is Muslim, it automatically makes him a terrorist. No, it does not. Okay, moving on. Uh, Judaism. Quick joke. That's actually true, actually. I'm probably part Jewish. I try and Jew every shopkeeper in this world there is. You got one that's $10? I'll say, no, I'll pay you 5 for it. That's what I do. It's the way I am. I'm cheap. Get it from my grandfather. Uh, Jews just believe that Jesus Christ has not come yet. Uh, whereas Christians do believe that Jesus Christ has come. And that, you know, he was died on the cross. And he was re resurrected from the dead. He's coming back whenever. Jews do not believe that. Jews believe that Jesus uh, has never has not been born yet. They believe that he's still to come. Uh, they were they believe in the Old Testament, which is the older part of the book before Jesus. Where Christians believe in the Old Testament and the New Testament, which is from Jesus' birth to Jesus' death, and then a few years after what his disciples did. Uh, and then the Revelations, the chapter of Revelations, the last chapter in the Bible, which or the last book, excuse me, in the Bible, uh, just describes the end of the world. What's going to happen? What's going to cause the world to end, and whatnot? Uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, those are just like the major religions, really. Uh, I don't really want to get into Mormon and Scientology. And, oh, atheists! Excuse me, I forgot about atheists. They, I don't know. My parents don't tell me about it because they're like, "Oh, it's stupid, stupid, stupid." Which I don't think it's stupid. I think it's interesting to learn about other religions and whatnot. Uh, I believe they they just believe that there is no God. They're just humans, and. Nothing happens to them when they die. They just die. I don't know. But that's about it. So thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Please comment, like, subscribe. And tell me what your take is on religions. Whether it be my religion or other religions. Please tell me. I'll read it. And if I can come up with a good response, I'll respond to you. Thank you. Bye.